channel if this is your first time welcome my name is Gabrielle I also go by Gaby and here on the channel we are Miss GCH and I'm really excited that you're here because today I'm cooking my first meal in my apartment and the cooking game is just not I'm not a bad cook I can follow a recipe but like cooking off the top of my head not my forte not really my forte but today we're gonna do it um, I got an air fryer and so I am going to be testing that out today. Uh, we're going to make Brussels sprouts with bacon. We're going to make also in the air fryer red potatoes, um, crispy red potatoes. And then I bought this steak today and <laughs> it's my first steak. I've never cooked steak but tonight we are gonna attempt to cook steak, okay? So, I just figured I would record this. I don't know how it's gonna turn out. I pray that all of this is edible because I spent money on it. Um, but yeah, I'm just bringing you guys along for the adventure because I don't really know what's about to happen. I really have no idea. Let's just hope for the best, okay? So, um, I don't have all my ingredients out. I just have the ones I literally just got done grocery shopping. If you've seen that video, you already know. So yeah, I'm just gonna get all of my ingredients out and then we'll get started. Um, 
I hope I caught it in the video, but I ended up putting the seasoning on both sides, putting it in a bag, and then putting Worcestershire, war, 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 whatever that word is, war, Worcestershire is in here. Um, I wasn't really measuring anything, because again, this is my first time really winging it, and I want to be one of those cooks that can just wing it and just do stuff, and it turns out good. So. I did follow recipes though for the air fryer um, red potatoes, so these are prepped. Um, and then we have our Brussels sprouts prepped. So I think we're gonna do steak first, so that while it's cooling, like the the potatoes and stuff, says those don't take long, like 10 minutes or so. So I don't know. Wait, should I make one and then do them? I think that's how we'll do it. Okay. Like Tabitha say, get into it, huh? Y'all, I'm about to throw down. Look at that. 
Okay, I really do love onions, so yes, I probably did a little extra. I didn't know how much of the steak I was gonna eat. Maybe I'll take some off and save some for the rest of the steak. But look, look at that man. I don't know I'm being extra. I just don't cook often. But I need y'all to know something. Oh my gosh. Mm. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Mm. That is now my steak. I I didn't do so hot on the steak. The texture is a little I mean it's not bad, it's flavor. Texture is interesting. See what I mean? It's low. Something. But you know, I'm so proud of this air fryer uh, little sides. Wow. This I just smashed. And I did mean smash. The only part about cooking that I don't like is this whole cleanup situation. But it's okay. I kind of cleaned as I went. So I don't have too much to do. And shout out to dishwashers. Hello. But my final review. Um, I'm going to give myself a 3.9 out of 5. Besides the Brussels sprouts and the potatoes, 5 out of 5. 10 out of 5. 100 out of 5. Honestly, truly, I mean the seasoning, the taste, the texture. That air fryer is, it's on to something. It's on to something. And I'm mad I'm late to the party. Um, the steak, the texture wasn't quite right. I think I'll put the Instagram clips in here of me eating it. You can kind of almost hear the texture. I don't know if it was the kind that I bought or what. So I'll work on my steak. Honestly, it was my first one, so I'm not really mad at myself. Um, I ate it all. My plate was empty, so it was good. And I still have, let me show y'all. I still have so many leftovers. That's the potatoes and steak and onions on top and Brussels sprouts left. Like, I'm gonna eat good tomorrow. So I am proud of myself. Even if no one else is, although several of you messaged me back on Instagram to tell me that everything was really good, so thank you. But um, yeah, I'm really liking this, and I think this air fryer is gonna be my excuse to actually cook, cause I don't always feel like doing the full pan on the stove, bacon, blah blah. But I do realize I was overthinking this. Like cooking is really mostly prep. Like it's not really about the. The actual cook part like the hard stuff is the prep so yeah once I thought about it like that I'm like okay I can do this so you know maybe there'll be like a cooking adventures little series on here I follow Raven Elise and she does Raven's Ratchet Kitchen I don't know if she still who has called me I don't know if she still does Raven's Ratchet Kitchen but mine is definitely gonna be a Ratchet Kitchen cuz I don't know what I'm doing but I think today was successful. So if you think everything I made today looked good and you're proud of me and you're excited for this journey, please make sure that you subscribe. If you don't know anything about my current journey, I did just move to Virginia. I don't know if I said that in the beginning, but I did. So um, yeah, there were several other things I'm supposed to be doing tonight, but I got carried away with this meal. So I hope you enjoyed watching. I hope you enjoyed my final product. And I hope to see you guys in the next video. Bye.